Hello. <laughs> Welcome back to GPA Play It Smart. Now we heard so far from high school student athlete Alisa Lendi Kane of Byron B. Thompson Academy. Mm -hmm. And HBU soccer player Chloe Maishiro. Our next athlete is Miss Hawaii 2009, Racine Anuinui Wolfer. Originally from Pearl City, Racine graduated from Yolani School in 2003 where she succeeded both academically and athletically. She played basketball, volleyball, and was part of the diet team. She also received the Iolani School Headmasters List Award. In 2003, she was admitted to the University of Hawaii, where she graduated with a degree in health studies in 2008. As a university student athlete, she played five seasons for the University of Hawaii Wahines. She received the UH Scholar Athlete and Dean's List Award. Aside from that, she also enjoys hula, surfing, paddling, and triathlon competition. In addition to Racine's academic and athletic talents, she also has a passion for service. Over the years, she has volunteered for the National Child Abuse Prevention Month, March of Dimes, Honolulu AIDS Walk, Group Hug for GIs, Read Out Loud America, and many others. Now, that's a lot of passion right there, and that is what you call a success story. Now let's hear from Racine. In June of 2009, Racine became the 65th Miss Hawaii. After being a runner-up in 2008, Racine made a successful comeback in 2009 with her graceful hula and heartfelt answers. Does Octomom deserve a TV reality show? Well, I feel that the story about Octomom is pretty intriguing, very interesting. I have to be honest, and I'll say no on that one, especially what with the exploitation of the John and Kate plus eight reality shows and things of that nature. I would have to say that children, especially in Octomom's case, um, they deserve a normal, fair development. So I feel that um, we should promote normalcy, especially for our kids. Thank you. Here we are at Ever Beach Elementary, celebrating Ever Beach Elementary's 50th anniversary. This is just one of the many events I do as Miss Hawaii, supporting the community, in this case, Ever Community. Why don't you come and join me in this awesome event? It's been absolutely incredible. Um, you know, I, I just recently got crowned, in fact, June 27th was uh, the big night of Miss Hawaii, and since then it's just been an awesome whirlwind adventure, uh, meeting a lot of different people, meeting a lot of new friends, um, getting to travel, getting to promote my platform, which is very dear to my heart. Um, it's called The Priceless Joy of Service, and it has to do with character development through, um, excuse me, through volunteering. And being Miss Hawaii is all about being a professional volunteer. So you guys go to Ever Beach Elementary, what grades are you in? I'm in fifth. Awesome, can I see your fish? Did you guys win this year? Audrea? As Miss Hawaii, Racine has a very busy schedule. In the midst of all her flights, interviews, photo shoots, and speeches, she was able to share with us her message and goals. I'll admit, I'm an athlete. I, I, I'm a jock, totally. Sports is what I love to do. And um, I soon found in high school and college 
that if I wanted to continue what I do, if I wanted to continue loving what I do, playing volleyball, playing sports, I had to succeed in school, of course. So it's almost like sports was my motivation for doing well in school, and that kind of translated into academic success. I attribute the large majority of my success to my ability to know myself. I know myself and I love myself and I believe in myself and those, I guess that, that essence is kind of what paved the way for my success is because I believe that I can do whatever I put my mind to do. Be the best person that you can be. Be the best you because the best you is the most successful you. Another message for high schoolers, for college students who are looking beyond on college, um, for anyone really who's looking for that next step in their lives, um, it's about serving others. It's about service, period, um, to your community, to your family, to yourself. Um, that's what the Miss Hawaii Crown is all about. That's what my purpose really is. It's, it's um, less about Racine and more everything about the message, everything about embracing the journey from where you are now to uh, where you want to be in life.